Hey, what's up, everyone? On this geek, um, I have downloaded the Windows uh, Blue, which is a giant update. Um, it's, it's other stuff built into one. It's like a security updates and updates for Windows 8 itself. And there's a bunch of other fe features that came with this um, this patch or update, whatever they want to call it. Um, it just gave more stuff to Metro and didn't really do anything else to anything else. Um, they said that they brought back the start menu, but they didn't really bring back the start menu. This right here pretty much just takes you to Metro. That's all it is, and it's nothing else. I think it's a very um, useless feature, and uh, if you guys are going to end up downloading it, don't download it because it's not going to be used for you. If you want an actual start menu, just go to the go to uh, start menu 8, type in it in Google, and it's uh, the website is called IOBit. And just download it from there and you just get yourself another start menu it's pretty much it's uh, just the same thing just like Windows 7 you can also have the uh, classic version of XP and Vista the same thing um, I'm gonna click on it and it's gonna take me to Metro as you can see and it takes me back if you right click and it just gives you the program features and mobility center power options event viewer system device manager network connections disk management computer management PowerShell and PowerShell for admin, task manager, control panel, file search, search, run, shut down, and desktop. And you're already on the desktop, so it really doesn't do anything. Um, I don't like Metro at all, so I just use Start 8. Um, you can use a free version called Start Menu 8, which is the website I told you earlier. And it just, it just pretty much is the exact same thing. Um, it's the exact same thing as a Start Menu as a Vista and 7. And you can even customize it to look like 8 instead of uh, using Metro. You can also shut it down on Metro. Uh, you don't have to like when you click on Start, uh, it just gives you the uh, menu. And when you go over here, it doesn't give you the sidebar. It, it just gives you um, it doesn't give you anything. You don't even have to go to Metro. It automatically starts your your computer or laptop to your desktop, and uh, it, it's a great feature. But um, yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. Um, Metro they gave you like a like bigger uh, tile boxes and stuff like that, and uh, they gave you more options for uh, the, the way the icons look like you'll get better icons your your de your background of your your tiles uh, it's, it's an animation you can add animation to it um, like for example if you wanted a if you wanted a, a if you want if you look at your weather when you start your laptop and like when you like the tiles or whatever they give you a bigger tile option and you can sh it shows you like all the days of um, what the weather's going to be look like it's more animated and more uh, colorful um, it's just it's just a bunch of it's it's a wasted feature um, do not download this unless you want to reformat your computer because that's pretty much what it does it formats your computer uh, it just changes every single thing it, it does save it for you it does save like uh, your documents, pictures, music, videos, and all that, um, unless they're in the specific folder that they need to be in. And it also does save your apps, but it reformats every single thing, everything else. It just it just changes it. Um, there's nothing good about this. The security updates you can get are just a regular updates and just updates by itself. But um, that's pretty much it, guys. Um, I have nothing else to talk about this thing. If you guys really want to know the details of this uh, Windows Blue, um, go ahead and uh, just look it up the facts. I'll have it in the description. Um, if I don't have a description, just remind me so I can add it. I do forget easily. But uh, yeah, this is um, pretty much it, guys. All right, this is Known as Geeks. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, rate, and comment. And if you guys have any issues with your computers and someone on YouTube doesn't explain it correctly or a bunch of people don't explain it correctly just let me know I will try to I'll try to simulate that problem on my virtual environment and once I get a uh, once I get a fix for you I'll explain it in detail and I'll upload it in YouTube within one or two hours uh, again guys this is known as Geeks thanks for watching and have a great day